I'm proud to announce we're going to bring back the original Crash, Crash 2, and Crash Warped, fully remastered from the ground up for PlayStation 4. So let's have a look at that. Crash is back in Pog form, and so are we with another round of Android ripoffs. After years of, um, it seems that the old Bandicoot is finally back in the cultural zeitgeist, which is really weird, mind you. Crash Bandicoot is popular in 2017. Crash. Bandicoot. But with any hype train comes the degenerate trash that rides the rails. And there's no better smelly old boxcar than the Google Play Store. The listings for crash related apps have certainly changed since the last video I made. So there's no better time to jump into that sewer. Hold on tight cause things are gonna get insane. You know, cause of, cause of the new game. Well friends. Welcome back to the jungle. Or should I say jungle? Cause today we're looking at Crazy Run Jungle Bandicoot. So at the very least, I'm expecting a runner about a bandicoot in the jungle. And he should be crazy. Or should I say, and say? No, God! Guide the jungle bandicoot to collect colorful fruit and weapon to attack enemy. Running and jumping on the road, and crush enemy with the Superboy. Ah yes, the ultimate weapon. At least I can say the screenshots look like a side-scrolling crash game. You've got Wumpa Fruits, all the right boxes, you play as something that looks like Crash. I'm sure it'll be at least a little like the actual games. Yep, spitting image. This is exactly how I remember the classic original Crash games. Oh look, the classic Crash Bandicoot question blocks. Oh, and how could I fail to mention this game's inclusion of Crash's famous mortal enemies? Mushrooms and turtles. See? Am I wrong? I don't know, at least there's some elements of actual Crash games in this. Like look at that, a crystal. Oh. It's bullets. What is this, Halo? Eh, this stuff's weird, but maybe the game's alright. Oh, ah, fuck! Wait, watch video to skip level? You live in a large city. Busy streets, crowds of people. Wow, it actually skipped it. Hmm. Oh, would you look at that? I beat the game. That was fun. Next down the grapevine, we've got Subway Crash Crazy Adventure. A new 3D runner where Crash has a full range of movement. So much goddamn movement. Subway Crash Crazy Adventure 3D. Enjoy playing Subway Crash Crazy Adventure 3D on this subway adventure jungle with Crash and be careful in adventure. No need to jetpack in Despicable Me. What? Oh god, his eyes! What's wrong with his eyes? I've seen things you people wouldn't believe. So here's the game, and I like how the logo clearly has a DeviantArt watermark on it. Now I know this guy didn't invent Crash Bandicoot, but he did make this HD logo, so yeah, they stole from him. Hmm, I should probably tell him, shouldn't I? Being a good Samaritan. And done. We're all about the greater good here on a mobile. Welcome to Tutorial! Let's get learn some moves. So, it's a 3D runner, right? And a clear as day ripoff of Subway Surfers, a popular infinite runner on both Android and iPhone. This all makes perfect sense. But what doesn't make sense is, 
If you want to trick people into downloading a Subway Surfers ripoff, why put the subway in the middle of a forest? That's not typically how subways work. If it's because of the Crash Bandicoot theme, you should have at least put him in the jungle. Ah damn, I'm justifying them. Well, if you like running Bandicoots, you'll go nuts about our next game, Bandicoot Runner. I mean, it's a Bandicoot, and it runs. What more do you need? Oh god. Oh no, this is the same exact game, isn't it? Wait... Why... He's wearing a hat. So this is the same exact game... Except now he's wearing a hat. I'm glad this exists. And the running never stops, cause next we've got Crazy Race HD. Another NEW game that's totally not the Crash Insane Trilogy. That would require actual effort to steal. Extreme Crash Racing Rush in 2D. Wait, this is 2D? You're kidding me! Also, I appreciate this game's attempt to manage your expectations. Don't expect a three-star game here, people. This is a solid two stars at best. Wait, that music. That menu. Oh no. Oh no. I thought I was done with you. No! And lastly, I've got a little something special. Since I did my last Crash video, I've received several messages about a certain game called Crazy Fox Adventure. Now, why would so many people be asking me about this? Have they all played it? What's so special about it? Or could it actually be good? Well, I'm determined to find out, because today we're going crazy with Crazy Fox Adventure. Or should I say... No! Crazy Fox Adventure is a side-scrolling Crash Bandicoot clone whose main draw is its level editor and large amount of user-created levels. Think Mario Maker, but instead it's Crash Bandicoot Maker. But shittier. Potentially. Probably. Alright guys, this better fucking wow me. Or I'm getting out the belt. So here we go. It's a side-scrolling Crash game, alright. Oh. But instead of pressing and holding virtual buttons, you swipe to do things. You swipe and hold left to move left, and you swipe and hold right to move right. <sighs> Why do you guys do this to me?